Lamborghini is advancing its journey toward electrification by introducing the Urus SE, an updated version replacing the Urus S. This move marks a significant shift for the Italian automaker's most family-oriented model, now equipped with a plug-in hybrid system. Named the Urus SE, it continues to utilize the MLB Evo architecture introduced in 2017. Positioned alongside prestigious SUVs like the Bentley Bentayga, Audi RS Q8, and Porsche Cayenne, the Urus SE distinguishes itself not only by its badge, but also by its enhanced performance. With nearly 70 more horsepower than its closest hybrid competitor and a 132 horsepower increase over its predecessor, the Urus SE takes a notable leap forward. In its plug-in hybrid iteration, the Lamborghini Urus SE not only delivers heightened performance but also demonstrates environmental responsibility, capable of operating silently in EV mode for an estimated 37 miles WLTP estimate. However, these figures merely scratch the surface, with deeper insights awaiting exploration. The 2025 Lamborghini Urus SE was unveiled ahead of the 2024 Beijing Auto Show, Auto China Beijing 2024, offering a glimpse into Lamborghini's future plans. Although not immediately available for purchase, those at the forefront of Lamborghini's customer priority list can expect delivery by the end of 2024, coinciding with the Urus SE's estimated release date. In the USA, the Urus SE will debut as a 2025 model. Regarding pricing and competition, while the Urus SE boasts a new powertrain, its competitors remain steadfast. The Porsche Cayenne Turbo e-Hybrid Coupe stands out as a direct rival, sharing both platform and engine similarities. However, the allure of the Lamborghini badge may also draw interest toward alternatives like the Ferrari Purosang, renowned for its naturally aspirated V12 engine, or the recently updated Aston Martin DBX 707, which addresses previous concerns about its infotainment system, aiming to challenge the best from Sanagata Bolognese. The pricing of the 2025 Lamborghini Urus SE isn't set in stone due to the plethora of customization choices available, rendering the base price more of a reference point than an actual payment. Nonetheless, a starting MSRP of $258,000, exclusive of taxes, represents a significant investment compared to the $237,848 price tag of its predecessor, the Urus S. However, it remains considerably more affordable than the nearly $400,000 required for the Ferrari SUV. Exterior and color updates for the new Lamborghini Urus SE. Addressing previous criticisms regarding its resemblance to other models in the Lamborghini lineup, the Urus SE undergoes notable exterior modifications to distinguish itself. The front end sees a redesigned hood with the shut line lowered to the top of the grille, creating a floating effect. Additionally, forward-facing creases replace the outward elements of the Urus S, while the grille gains vertical expansion, imparting a more imposing presence. The Matrix LED headlights adopt a narrower profile, abandoning the Y-shaped LED daytime running light signature for a sleeker C-shaped design encircling the housing. At the rear, the Urus SE maintains its distinctive quartet of tailpipes nestled within a wide diffuser, now contributing to a 35% increase in downforce compared to its predecessor. The rear bumper receives a refined design, with a full-width hexagonal mesh-look element connecting the subtly revised taillight clusters. These are accompanied by a more prominent ducktail spoiler and a larger roof-mounted spoiler. Further aerodynamic improvements, including underbody air ducts enhancing engine cooling by 15% and a 30% boost in brake cooling, remain concealed. In terms of customization, the Urus SE showcases 23-inch Galanthus alloy wheels paired with bespoke Pirelli P0 tires. However, customers have the flexibility to select from a range of wheel designs spanning 21 to 23 inches in diameter, with the option of Pirelli Scorpion 2 winter tires. The exterior palette offers over 100 vibrant color choices, including two new hues introduced at launch. Here are the details about the Lamborghini Urus SE in Arancio Egon, orange, and Bianco Safras, white. Dimensions? The 2025 Urus SE has undergone a slight size increase due to its redesign, but overall dimensions remain similar. It retains a 118.2-inch wheelbase, with a slightly longer overall length of 201.7 inches due to the new front and rear designs. 
The height remains at 64.5 inches, and the width, including mirrors, 79.6 inches without, stays unchanged at 85.9 inches. While Lamborghini didn't explicitly disclose the curb weight, the addition of a 25.9 kilowatt-hour battery pack indicates an expected weight gain. With a claimed power-to-weight ratio, the Urus SE is estimated to weigh 5,520 pounds, nearly 700 pounds heavier than its predecessor, the Urus S, with a front-slash-rear weight distribution of 54 to 46. Engine-slash-powertrain and performance The Urus SE features the same 4.0-liter twin-turbo V8 engine as its predecessor, producing 612 horsepower and 590 lbft of torque. Additionally, it is complemented by an electric motor generating an extra 189 horsepower and 356 lbft. Combined, these systems deliver maximum outputs of 789 horsepower and 701 lbft. The 25.9 kilowatt-hour lithium-ion battery pack powers the electric motor, situated in the Urus SE's trunk above an electronically controlled rear differential. The e-motor is integrated into the 8-speed automatic transmission. In electric mode, the Urus SE can travel approximately 37 miles at speeds of up to 81 miles per hour. Despite its weight, the Urus SE achieves impressive performance figures, with electric torque effortlessly compensating for its mass. It boasts a weight-to-power ratio of 7 pounds per horsepower, resulting in enhanced performance over the Urus S. Notably, it achieves a top speed of 193.9 miles per hour, positioning it as the world's fastest SUV, narrowly surpassing the previous leader, the DBX 707, which can reach 193 miles per hour. Enhancing its straight-line capabilities, the Urus SE introduces a novel centrally mounted longitudinal electric torque vectoring system. This system employs an electro-hydraulic clutch pack to distribute power between the front and rear axles. Additionally, a new limited slip differential on the rear actively adjusts torque from left to right, resulting in what Lamborghini describes as on-demand oversteering. These features are bolstered by a 48-volt anti-roll system and an adjustable air suspension, capable of increasing ground clearance. In its sportiest mode, the suspension can lower by 0.6 inches, while it can raise by nearly 3 inches for challenging terrain. Accompanying these enhancements are revised drive modes, offering six options, each with four electric performance strategies, EPS EV drive, hybrid, performance, and recharge. The combination of drive modes and EPS selections provides a wide range of driving experiences tailored to various conditions. 1. Strata, Street, 2. Sport, 3. Corsa, Track, 4. Snow, 5. Sabia, Sand, 6. Terra, Earth slash Mud, Gas Mileage slash Range, Charging, and Battery Life. While official U.S. EPA fuel consumption and range figures are pending, Lamborghini estimates an electric drive